good to go. Today is October 14th, 2016, invoice number 3945. We have video scanning the living room fireplace, approximately 25 feet tall, 13 by 13 flue, proceeding down with video scan. You can see the creosote at the top of the cap. You see how shiny that is, reflecting right back at us. We are proceeding downward. Is stuff? Yep. That's the third stage creosol. Okay. Um, also, when we went all the way to the top, at the, the bottom of the cap, the lid, you could see all the creosol pretty much just shining right back down oh, at us. Nice. Yeah. Okay. And keep in mind, as you have your fires, this will actually become uh, in, in a combustible state. It starts to get very soft and at that point... Tarry. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Just think of like tar on a hot summer day. Right. Now we already uh, completed the video scan downstairs in the gas flow. Right. How does that look? Um, there were many issues in there. A lot of breaks, um, a lot of cracks. There was one hole that was pretty significant in there as well. Um, so that's definitely going to require further attention to get okay. get that where it needs to be, unfortunately. Alrighty. Wow, that's pretty bad. Look at that. Based upon just the quantity of fires, essentially, um, it could have this could have been due to um, you know lack of proper maintenance. Um, I know that the previous owners used used these things, which I never used. These like starter logs. I wonder if these things. I mean, they're, um, they're like a really soft kind of. Putty. I don't think it would be those so much. That includes the video scan for today. I don't think it's so much those. I think.